Novak Djokovic's six-year winning streak at the Australian Open came to an end in the semi-final. Novak Djokovic looks set to take a five-week break from competition after crashing out of the Australian Open. The world number one's 33-match, six-year winning streak in Melbourne came to an end when he lost to Janik Sinner in Friday's semi-final. And Djokovic could now be out of action until March as he admitted he couldn't plan his tournament schedule until he calmed down. Djokovic lost his first Australian Open match since 2018 as he threw in an uncharacteristic, error-filled performance against Sinner, who beat the 10-time champion 6-1, 6-2, 6-7, 6-6-3. As well as snapping his winning streak in Melbourne, it also ruined Djokovic's perfect record in Australian Open semi-finals, as he had previously gone on to lift the title every time he reached the last four. After the match, the gutted top seed claimed that it was one of the worst Grand Slam matches I've ever played, and confessed that he never really found his best tennis during the tournament. Instead of bouncing straight back and trying to find his top level, it could now be a while until tennis fans see Djokovic on the match court. According to his website, the 36-year-old's next tournament will be the Indian Wells Masters, which starts on March 6. It means there are more than five weeks until his next tournament, with Djokovic choosing to skip the Dubai Championships in February, which he has played for the last two years. But Djokovic's calendar remains uncertain as he told Serbian media that he wouldn't be able to plan his upcoming tournaments until he processed his disappointing defeat in Melbourne. Let's see how things will unfold in the future. When you leave the court after a loss, the head is still hot, you are fighting to be rational, but there are many irrational thoughts going through your head, the world number one said per tennis majors. I want my thoughts to settle, when I calm down. I will move on and see what tournaments I will play. I made a commitment to myself that I will give it my all this year, with the priority being slams and the Olympics. We'll see whether something will change. In this stage of my life and my career some surprising decisions are maybe more expected compared to 20 years ago.